K-I-L-R Taylor Games Hello Minecrafters and gamers and those that just love an adventure and a good time, welcome to the Minecraft Survival Showcase where we check out a map that I didn't create, <laughs> that uh, users like you uh, have created uh, big maps and we check it out in survival mode. Why? Because that gives us a chance to just check every little, um, uh, every everything that's in there, you know, and be able to appreciate all the work that was put into these. It's one thing to go into creative mode and just fly around, but it's a completely different thing to go into survival mode and just check out um, the buildings and what's inside and the decorations and... Uh, for those of you who have been following this uh, series from the beginning, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Uh, because you've seen uh, all the wonderful uh, things that we've seen in these houses and these sky rises. And it's great uh, if you're looking for ideas for your own builds. Um, I see a lot of things in here um, that I would love to implement in my own stuff. But, um, yeah, this is a really fun series, and it's one, one of the popular series that I have on this channel, uh, along with the Flight Simulator stuff. But uh, if you haven't been watching this series and you're just joining in, um, there is a playlist uh, for Greenfield. So if you like uh, what you see and you enjoy and want to see more, uh, there's the uh, playlist is in the description and you can go ahead and check that out and see everything that is available so let's go ahead and talk about where we're at and whereabouts where we're going so what we're looking at here this is uh if you were to download the map which you can off of uh i think it was planet minecraft where i got it uh this map comes with it and this city is divided into uh, sections or subdivisions, you know, whatever you, you know, whatever you want to uh, refer to it as. And we've, we started off here in Springfield and we checked out Melrose. We checked out half of Glenview, um, this half here. And then we came over to Clinton and Ashfield West. And then we are, came over to Ashfield Central, and there is just so much going on here uh, that it's been taking us several episodes just to explore. Uh, we've checked out all of this, and the stadium, and this, and we kind of worked our way around. And now what we're, we're at is over here, in this area. Um, we're actually specifically right here. And we've been checking out some shops and we already checked out this residential uh, skyrise building which is uh, pretty cool um i i must say but yeah we'll go ahead and we'll continue checking this out down here and uh then we'll be working our way on the other side of the freeway there's actually like an alleyway oh no that's a street that actually connects um that we can check out here along with these buildings and then we'll work our way down uh, and this won't all be on this episode but we'll wor work our way down and we'll start checking out all these buildings that are along this uh, diagonal road um, so hopefully within the next five episodes we'll be done with Ashfield Central and we'll be back up into Glenview finishing up uh, this half of it and for those of you who love the map crafter uh, maps which I do I have this all rendered out in uh, all four directions in 
And so we are over here in between this now. Like I said, I have it in different directions here. So we are in here. And what I liked about this uh, residential sky rise here were these colored uh, glass uh, decoration things. I thought those were kind of neat. Uh, but yeah, we're in here. That is where we're at. And we'll be checking out... I think we've already checked out these uh, buildings here, but we'll double check. Uh, but then we've got this building uh, here, which is... Hi, Hi area, Hi area. I'm not sure what that. We'll we'll find. We'll be able to see it more when we get over there. Um, and these again look like apartment complexes, which are what we saw all over here. But we'll still check these out. And yeah, we've already looked at these buildings here. <laughs> these are all like apartment complexes. But uh, that is our plan, and then we'll be working our way over on the other side of the freeway. So here we are. We are back in Greenfield. We have moved our way uh, from over here. I'll check some doors that a... Uh, Zombie had broken. <laughs> so we checked out all this over here. As you can see, we kind of broke our way in there. But yeah, there is a, a little flower flower stand. Taste of Paris. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and check out what we got over here. My goodness, the graphics are a little choppy here. Uh, let me see what setting I've got. Okay, I had the distance uh, out a little further. That's a little better. We don't need to have a completely, you know, full uh, way out. So. Now, we haven't been in here, but this looks very similar to the garage and apartment complexes that are on the other side. But still, let's do that. Crap, where is he? Dang it. Anyone remember when the skeletons didn't didn't used to move all over the place? Man, I do. Well, so much for that garage. <laughs> uh, sorry for whoever uh's garage that is. That'll be him. Sorry. What, look, he's like, look, there's a hole here. What did you do? <laughs> this would be great if these buttons actually worked. And it was tied to redstone or command block. And, you know, the garage door would go up. That'd be sweet. Wait. I don't know if this was done on purpose, but look at this. What does that remind you of? I'll give you a hint. <laughs> I don't know if that was intentional. Oh wait, look at this. Well that's a cool idea for a light. That's an interesting design. Okay, well there ain't nothing in here. What did you find? Oh yeah, this is... There's a hole up there. No, that's glass. Um, I don't... Design-wise, I think you would have been better off putting a glass block. Because, um... You know, there's no little ceiling thing right there. So, I think a glass block would have been better. And I... I 
but other you know I love how they did this here but you can see there is um, another residential sky rise over there wait a minute I think I'm turned around I am I'm sorry we have been over here <laughs> We were checking out these uh, shops on this side because we didn't the first time. Okay. Sorry, folks. No wonder they look the same because they, they are the same. Okay, but these here we have not looked at. My goodness. So many of these are lawnmower over here. Okay, so we got ourselves some parking spots. I'm not sure what the yellow represents. Handicap parking, maybe? Or just maybe it's just a simple design. Let's go in here. I bet it's going to be scary. Because it's pretty dark. Oh, no, this is a little different than that other one. This has got stairs that go up. Yeah, this, I mean, that other residential uh, complex did not look like this. So this, this, this is unique. I like this. I'm just going to... Put torches all over the place. Bar. Oh, we got a light right there. This is cool. I like that. With the uh diagonal. There's no other door. Thought there was. Ah, oh, here we go. Something tells me I'm not going to be able to sleep. Oh, yes. Cool. Don't think I've seen a bed that big before. I guess that's a king size bed. <laughs> Now, something else that I've talked about are these. Now, some of you may be wondering, what in the heck kind of object is that? I've never seen that before. Uh, these are custom heads. That's what those are. Well, I'm in, God, they made that higher. That's kind of cool. But yeah, you can uh, get custom heads like this and, and put them into your, <coughs> your build. So, just... Check that out. What's in this room here? Um, a sink or a bath? Not quite. I think this is supposed to be a bath, but it's a really small one. There's a shower. Yeah, that. I think that's a bath. Back out here in the common area. Lighten things up here. So these rooms are 
copies, you can tell that. We need a couple of villagers in here. There, you like dark. <laughs> you stay in there. They're having a family get together. Need some downstairs there. All right. That's what we're talking about. Let's keep going upstairs here. And we must be towards the top. Ah! He was like waiting for me. Where's that? Oh, he busts at the door. There we go. That should help. These are all generally the same. Let's see. What do we have up here? Oh, wait. I know. That's the air conditioner thing up there. So, how many people um, who design uh, houses and buildings like this, how many of you all play The Sims? I'm really curious because some of the stuff that I see reminds me of like builds in The Sims. I'm willing to bet this is going to look the same. So I think what they did was what MC Edit. They took probably took this, copied it, and turned it at an angle and put it right there. That's going to be my guess. Let's just take a quick look in here. Choose the actual door. Oh, it was closed. <laughs> yeah, that looks pretty much the same. Okay. Now we're over in the spot that I thought we were. So, we've been into uh, this area... Still got villagers. Yeah, you know we've been over here because the villagers have went over here. So we got the 88, which actually I think stands for... Oh, that is 88. Look at that. That is an 8. I thought it was a B. Because I see, like, Bruisewell coffee, and then there was something else over here that said... Yeah, the Brownstone Books. That's a BB. That's so... I was getting confused on whether that was an 88 or a BB. Well, when you look at that, that's clearly an 8. And we went into this store. The Dam Neil. Dam Neil building. Built in 1910. Yeah, that's the fish store. Hey, what do you think about that fish? <laughs> They're like, stinks in there. Feel sorry for that one. <laughs> oh, it smells bad. Pew. Imperial Cafe. Hey, did I get any... Any zombie flesh here? Oh, yes, I did. There you go. We're still looking for some zombie flesh to give our... To give our buddy... Oh, we must have... I, 
keep I'm wondering, did we go in here or did the villagers come in here? Maybe they found their way in here. Ice blocks. <laughs> Maybe it's a freezer. <laughs> Brr. This looks like the first computer computer monitor that I've seen that um, doesn't have anything on it. How did they get this custom head to like this little piece is lower than that, and that piece looks like I'm not sure. That's th I need to look that up and see how in the world people did heads like that. That way you can make your own custom heads and put them into the into the game. What is this anyway? I don't know. Let's, Let's find out. Bunch of wash bins. Maybe this is a laundromat. Hold on. We need some people washing their clothes here. There you go. <laughs> ah, I don't know what to do. <laughs> this doesn't make any sense. I love the color glass on this. This is just, just different, you know? I, I've just not seen anything like that. All right, what's in here? A garage. Well, we know what we found in this place. Apparently, no mobs. Oh! Okay, uh, I take that back. There are mobs. <laughs> or that one uh, just happened. And I just got his tail to go back up, too. Stupid. Maybe I should have him sit somewhere. Hey, buddy. Just come over here. Go, let's go to Nostalgia Inc. Uh, Internet Cafe. Come on in here. Come on in here. Yeah, there you go. This looks pretty decently lit. Go ahead and sit right there. And I'll I'll get you some uh, zombie flesh and, and get you back here. This is cramped. <laughs> How do you get to the computer way back there? Jump, jump, jump. Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> hey, there's a way around this way. <laughs> Pretty crammed in here. Oh man. This internet cafe is racist. It's only uh, Windows XP. Let's see something else. Let's see some Linux uh, systems. Of course we got this computer oh. thing here. I'm curious. Is this a... Map? Nope. Must be a design block or something. I've been seeing this quite a bit, wondering... But I see, like, different types of styles, and I'm just like... What kind of blocks are they... Well, let's find out. Let's find out. Um, okay. I can't do anything there. Is that bedrock? <laughs> Maybe it's bedrock. And they changed the style on it. Alright, it's getting dark. Let's go over to the one that's lit. And we'll find a bed and... Oh, two creepers. Oh, well, that'll be fun. There we go. Not that one. Not that one. Okay. Alright, fine. I'll just light one up then.
there. And it's morning. There we go. And in case you're wondering, the music you're hearing is from C418. Um, this is one of my resource packs that I put together to get his music in the actual game. Exit only. So I've got his music from other albums. And I don't have everything. Uh, cause some of it just doesn't quite fit with Minecraft. But there's a lot that does. You know what? It's, I don't have very many torches left. <laughs> I don't have a whole lot of glowstone left either. Toll booth. That's cool. I like that. So, here's an idea for you if you're looking to put a toll booth. You know, oh, and if you want to animate it, have it to where, you know, maybe you've got a um, proximity uh, command block. And then what it does is it takes these and moves them so that way it's vertical, but it'll go through the uh, ceiling there. But, yeah, you could do that. That way, when you get up there, or suppose you have something where you have to deposit uh, a certain item, and then it goes up. You could also do a uh, structure blocks and have it animate. So you got it at a diagonal and back up. So... There are so many possibilities that you can do with this city. And if you're good with command blocks and uh, redstone, you could really make your, uh, your city alive. And I haven't seen anyone actually do that yet. Bookshell made by Lemmy Moore. Mm, I like the colors. Oh, and I love that too. The how the all the lights are in here, and then of course um, with the shaders, you got nice reflections too. So this is cool, and it's well lit too. I like this. It's almost like uh, glowing icicles in here. All right, so let me more. This is cool. I like that. Checkers clothing shop. Let's go check in here. Now I've seen this. We we saw this in another shop, where it looked it looked like it was you know like a like a wardrobe you know closet that's got clothes or something hanging in there. And I love this. I love this idea. You know what we could do though? Take it a step further is um, use custom banners that actually look like an outfit, whether it's a, a shirt or you know shirt and pants or something. This is a good idea for like fabric, like a fabric store. Just throwing my ideas out there. It'd take a lot of work to come up with a lot of banners, but... <laughs> you ain't getting into that dressing room. We will, though. <laughs> that is a custom painting, I'm pretty sure. Let's find out. Nope, that's a banner. Oh, not a... Right 
there. Well, that was the wrong one. <laughs> Yep, that looks like that belongs. <laughs> this is just neat. I love the work that these people do. Hybrid. Oh, that's what that said up there. Hybrid printing. So they put... Oh no, th that's right. The carpet's acting like a block. Huh. Cool idea. Need some customers. And we need some work. People working here. There we go. That's better. That doesn't look like a good idea. Oh, I got more glowstone. Okay. You know, I didn't look to see if there was another, um... Oh, that's what that is, apparently. Okay, well, apparently there's something up there. I think we got stairs. That's going to take forever. Okay, so we got some offices over here. The archives! Definitely need a light over there. That one don't work. Let's fix that. There we go. That's weird. Oh, maybe that was just glass. I was just thinking... Let's see, did we get any... No, we didn't get any glowstone. So that must have been an honest error right there. I'm, I'm pretty sure that that was not supposed to be there. But then again... You know, you're in, you know how you are in uh, office buildings and they have a light that's burned out? <laughs> there you go. That maybe, maybe they really did mean to put that there. Well, see, they got some over here, but. Okay, guys, get to work. Get, yeah, get to work. Stop fooling around. Yeah, stop. Get to work. Who brought their kid? He brought his kid to work day. <laughs> Where the heck were the stairs? Oh, here they are. Let's... It's getting darker. Yeah, this looks the same. Archives. Okay, so you can see that they copied the floors. Let's keep going up. Going up, 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 up. We are on the top. Okay, and there's the elevator. That's another thing, too. I would love to see a working elevator in these builds. Okay, now one thing we didn't look at, we were over here, and we just looked at the ground level. 
I don't know if there's another level up here. Let's take a look. Okay. Well, we look that way. No. Okay. We didn't miss anything. Oh, wait a minute. There is a ceiling over there. There may be another floor that we didn't look at. Okay, this is where we make our elevator here. Nope. And down we go. Alright, let's go back to our room over here. I forgot which one it was. It wasn't there. Here it is. Man, those zombies, they're just destroying everything. Okay, here we go. Yeah, we we went in here, but we didn't We didn't see what was up on the upper levels. Hey, I got some more zombie flesh for you. There you go. I'm sure that'll help you out. Yeah, there's nothing here. I think we're going to have to find our way up there. Unless the parking garage goes up there. You know what? It might. And these look well lit, but... Oh, jeez. Zombies are still... Mobs are still... Are still spawning. I'll tell you what, it does not take much. Alright, let's... Break the walls down here and see if we can find out... Ah, okay. We must have missed it. There's a stairway coming up here. A stairway to what? A stairway to heaven. <laughs> There's my glowstone here. What do we not need here? Ah, we can throw that stuff out in a bit. I was like, that's weird. Okay, so, you know, some apartments that are kind of squeezed in here in between. I guess that's a bedroom. Nope, bathroom. That's probably the bedroom. Yep. What do we got across? Oh, sorry, that's the hallway. <laughs> Let's take a look in here. All right. Ah, it's over here. I think that's a different carpet than what we saw on the last one. And different uh, dining table. Designed a little differently, actually. Sorry, busted your wall. There you go. Well, it doesn't look like anything is up there. Well, that's definitely the top. Oh, there is. 
is a door. How could we miss that? Probably because there was an, ac an actual door. I just saw the glass and I went right by it. Yep, we looked at this. We created a mess of water over here, but... Alrighty, seems good. We'll go ahead and stop it here, and uh, we'll be working our way. Uh, we should be on the other side of the freeway in the next episode. So, thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe, because that really helps out the channel. Uh, let's other uh, viewers out there. This will show up in their feed. Um, there's a lot of Minecrafters out there that I think would be very interested in seeing what Greenfield has to offer. Um, and, you know, and they, and they may not want to just go into the game, you know, they just might be interested in seeing a video, you know, something they can just turn on where they're doing something in the background. So be sure to like and subscribe so that way uh, more people are, are aware of the channel and the videos that are out. And the notification bell is just for you uh, so that way you know when the next video is uploaded just looking around making sure there's not some creeper creeping behind me anyway thanks for watching and i will see you on the next episode